Looks to me like Christmas came a little bit early. Got a present from the folks over at Hasbro. Yes, I got this giant box. Thank you to the folks over at Hasbro for taking the time and sending this my way. The box, in fact, is so big. How big is it? It's so big, in fact, that I'm actually opening it up here in my living room. We're going to go ahead and open this up. Even though it does say, do not open. Just kidding. This is awesome. We're going to go ahead and open this up. This huge box, again, coming to us from the folks over at Hasbro promoting the new Bots Bots. This is the hashtag Bots Bots Challenge. I'm up for the challenge. Let's go ahead and get this opened up. Just before we do that though, I also got myself a little envelope and I'm just holding the camera in my hand. I'm gonna go ahead and open up the envelope. Actually, I've already opened it up and I got myself a Bots Bots invite. It, uh, it says mischievous and unpredictable introducing a new Transformers line, crossing that out, which I guess would be the mischievous and unpredictable Transformers line. More coming soon. Let's go ahead and open that up and see what we got inside. There we go. Turn it around. It says, you are cordially invited to our virtual grand opening celebration. Hold your own exclusive ribbon cutting ceremony and be one of the first to explore the shops in our brand new shopping mall. You will also get an opportunity to participate in an exciting new challenge. See you there. And then down below, you've got the uh, little cutting, little cutting scissors, which if I'm looking at this correctly, it looks like the scissors transforms. Make sure you bring these perfectly ordinary scissors to cut the ribbon at the opening ceremony. The scissors actually even transform into this adorable little bot bot. How cool is that? Well, we're going to go ahead and, like I said, let's go ahead and get this box opened up. You'll probably see there's a whole bunch of like little bumpers around my fireplace. It's just so the baby doesn't fall and hurt herself. So let's go ahead. Maybe not necessarily use these scissors, but we're going to go ahead and grab some ordinary cutting scissors and we'll go ahead and cut the box right open. As I run my scissors along the opening flap of the box, I just want to give you guys the heads up that Bot Spots should now be available in retail stores, should you guys wish to pick these ones up for yourself. And we're going to go ahead and get the flap completely open. I may or may not have actually opened these on the wrong side. Didn't really actually say a top or a bottom side. Well, we've got hashtags, upside down, mind you. We've got hashtags, bot, bots, challenge. Once opened, we get ourselves a really neat little storefront. On the top there, you've got Transformers, bot, bots, grand opening, hashtag, bot, 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 bots, challenge. And then we've got ourselves a real working ribbon. Now I can go ahead and cut that ribbon. Probably wouldn't be able to do it necessarily with the little small bot bot that I've got right here. He's not, of course, sharp enough to cut that. But we're going to go ahead and grab our scissors. I feel as if we should have a small band performing in the background. Somebody with a trumpet. And we cut the ribbon. And let's unveil the bot bots. And I have not opened this yet, so this is going to be a first time experience for me. Looks like there's some Velcro flaps on the top. Let's open that up on the one side. And stuff not hopefully falling too much out. We're going to open up the other side. And look at all the stuff that's inside this box. We've got ourselves some artwork there on the side. The various different lines of bot bots. We've got the Lost Bots. The Greaser Gang. The Techie Team. Those are going to be pretty cool. And the Shed Heads. On the other side of the box... We've got the Jock Squad, the Backpack Bunch. Down below, we have the Toilet Troop. That's going to also be fun. And the Sugar Shocks. Packed to the rim would certainly be a way to describe this set. Oh, boy, there's a lot of stuff happening right here. Uh, for starters, we've got the Bot Bots Series 1 Capsule Blind box blank capsule uh, figures inside. There are 24 to collect, which I'm assuming are not going to be the exact same ones that are going to be available in the more visible sets right here. Uh, as we move along the top here, we've got some Series 1 bot bot blind capsules. Down below, we have the actual three packs or multiple packs. There are the, on the ones on the end, let me just pull out one of them here. Here are one of the individual setups. And it looks like we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. And then potentially an eighth one inside the little capsule right there. There's the ones on the back. Series one. This is of the Greaser Gang. 
And then we've got some smaller sets. Let's see if I can grab those out. This seems to go on for forever. How many are in here? There's one, there's two, there's three. Looks like there's three, possibly four per tray. Here's another one of these. It's the Bot Bots, and uh, this one happens to be the Sugar Shocks. One looks to be a donut, a cupcake, or pencil. Not really sure how pencil plays in with the Sugar Shocks. There's also looks what to be a football there. There's the back of it right there. And then there's this part right here. It says start here. I guess I, <laughs> I guess I should have started there. Let's go ahead and pull this out and see what we've got inside. Inside the section that says start here, I <clears throat> didn't start there. We got a read up for Bot Bots. Welcome to the world of Bot Bots. You are one of the first to meet the Bot Bots news, most mischievous Transformers line. What are Bot Bots? Bot Bots are Transformer figures that convert into everyday items, such as pencil sharpener, plunger, or cupcake. Bot Bots are grouped into tribes, such as the Sugar Shocks or Jock Squad. All the bot bots are mischievous and unpredictable. Where did they come from? You may ask, yells the person in the back of the audience. Transformers Energy, known as Energon, hit a mall, and some of the things inside became more than meets the eye. They became bot bots. The bot are disguised as stuff we use every day, hiding in plain sight, as they cause all sorts of mayhem in the mall, except the bot bot challenge. Opening that up completely, the bot bots need your help to hide in plain sight so they can cause maximum chaos. Bot bot teams have been formed, so dive into the packs and pop out bot bots figures until you've completed a tribe. When you've got a team, pose them together in a space where they can best hide and carry out their sneaky, silly, totally unplanned plans. For example, place the shed heads in a garage or the greaser gang in a kitchen. Once the tribe you selected has been posed, post the picture of the scene you created with bots, bot, 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 challenge. Ask viewers to see if they can spot the bots. There you go. We hope you participate and enjoy the bot, bots product. Again, thank you to the folks over at Hasbro for making this possible. Anything on the back? There's a little read up here that looks like it's been crossed out. I guess this should have been the first thing I read. Ultimately, I read the back here. And then we look, looking further, we've also got ourselves a poster. One side of the poster, as you can see, has the various different tribes, the Toilet Troop, the Techie Team, the Jock Squad, the Sugar Shocks, Backpack Bunch, the Lost Bots, Greaser Gang, and Shed Heads. On the back, however, you get yourself a full checklist showing you the various different bot bots. The fact as well that this is also showing as Series 1, there is 119 coming also in Series two, I'm guessing, in 2019. And there's the various different ones. I feel as if the ones I'm gonna have the most fun with are probably gonna be the Greaser Gangs. Sup, dog! Okay, I definitely have to review that one first and foremost. Deuteroni, Angry Cheese. This one is Foddle Barts, Shredder Jack, Hot Diggity. <laughs> Fantastic names. There's also the Shredheads, Sugar Shocks, the Techie Team, and the Toilet Troop. Stinkosaurus Rex. Fine work. If I actually had another pair of hands, which I don't because that would make me a mutant, I would applaud the names that they've actually chose. Stinkosaurus Rex. Fine work. Virtual clap to you, Hasbro. Virtual clap. So there is the full lineup for the 2018 Bot Bots from the folks over at Hasbro. Again, a big thank you to Hasbro for taking the time and sending this my way. I think I'm going to have some absolute fun opening these ones up. Oh, oh, wait. Is this some of the ones here that I'm looking at? There's the cheese, the grilled cheese. Is that a grilled cheese? I think it's a grilled cheese sandwich. I'm definitely going to be having a look at these in the next series of reviews. So if you guys have not had a chance to hit that little subscribe button down below, what are you waiting for? We're going to have a look at some bot bot uh, collectible transformers in some upcoming video reviews. I'm definitely looking forward to having a look at these. Uh, this kind of reminds me of the stuff that we got from like the McDonald's lineups, the fast food premiums back in the day. And I'm glad to see that they've come back smaller, yes, but they've come back in a big way with the new Transformers bot bots. Today we were doing an unboxing. Why don't we actually close up shop to finish off this presentation? There we go. We were having a look at this giant-sized box 
delivered to me by the folks over at Hasbro. This was the Transformers Bot Bots grand opening, which would also be the grand opening of when we're going to have a look at these uh, figures on this channel. So stay tuned for that. As always, guys, thanks for watching, as you always do. And I'll see you next time.